Hey you guys, so I'm trying the natural light thing. I'm like in front of my window because I'm moving so I packed up everything else. But I'm trying the natural light so let me know how you guys like this or not. Let me see a lamp. You can't even tell that I'm putting this natural lamp on right now. It's, it's stupid. You can't even tell. But whatever. Anyway, um, I'm going to do the I heart is that a heart there we go no wait fix it turn <laughs> the i heart drugstore makeup tag um i love drugstore makeup so no one tagged me in this i just watched a couple of them and i i liked them so i decided to do it uh so if you see me looking down i'm actually looking at my phone because i have the questions on my phone so let's get started. The first question is, what is your favorite drugstore makeup brand overall? I think I'm going to go with Revlon. Yeah, I'll go with Revlon because I love their foundation. I love their uh, lip colors. I forgot what they're called actually. But I just, I bought one and I ran out. So I said when I go back, I'm going to get all of them. So yeah, that's my favorite line. Um... What are your favorite favorites? What is wrong with me? What is your favorite face, cheek, and lip product? Uh, my favorite face would have to be the Revlon Color Stay. I am in the color 320 True Beige. Uh, I love this stuff. It it gives you it's full coverage, I believe. I go normal to dry skin as well, like also. It does, I believe it's full coverage, but it still gives you a nice finish. It doesn't look like you just packed a bunch of makeup on your face, so I love that. Um, cheek, don't laugh at me, y'all, okay? It's, okay, it's wet and raw, wet and raw, wet and wild. Gosh, why can't I talk? It's wet and wild, um color icon this is in the color something pink pearl acid pink my daughter it looks the case looks look at look at that my daughter found it and broke it and like dropped it so i have to go get some more but i can't find this color but this is my favorite cheek right here uh what was that face cheek and lips my favorite lip product right now uh, i've been loving red lips this is more of a i don't know what this is this is a dark wine i'll show you that product because it, it'll be in the rest of this too it'll be in this video as well but uh i've been loving red lips so i use the nyc lip stain 16 hour um, it says it's smudge proof, but this is what it looks like. And it's like that, and you kind of just, I don't want to, yeah, I'm sorry, I was testing out which lipstick I wanted to put on today. But, yeah, it's just like that. So I've been using this, like, under all of my red lipsticks that I wear, which I usually wear. It's like a red gloss, but it's not drugstore, so I'm not going to put it in here. Um... Sorry if y'all hear my baby in the background. She's mad right now because she's in trouble. She has to stay in her room for a while. Uh, anyways, let's see. Uh, my least favorite product will have to be... Oh. This is the Wet n Wild Ultimate Match uh, Liquid Foundation. I, I don't... I don't like this. Um... I paid like $5 for it. And I was like, oh, Wet n Wild has a foundation. Let me try it. And it, I hate it. As you can see, it's like, it's full. Like, I used it probably twice. First time I used it, I was like, okay, maybe I need to try it a different way. I used it with a brush the first time. And then the second time, I used it with a um, beauty blender. But I I don't like this stuff. This is This is horrible. It feel, It's like super sheer and thin and it just feels like there's nothing there and I don't know. I don't like it. 
Um, let's see. The next question is, what is the best makeup bargain? Okay, so I just got these, like yesterday. This is the Wet n Wild lipstick. Um, these two. I got these from Walgreens yesterday. This is a, these were a true bargain. These were um, sixty nine cent. Like, okay, let me just show. okay. This one I have on my lips right now. So I'll just let's go over here. I'll just swatch that. Look at that. Like I'm in love with this stuff right now. Matter of fact, I honestly think I want to make these like my favorite lip product because I am in love with this. That was um dark wine this one is nouveau nouvelle i believe that's how you say it nouvelle pink whatever but yeah look at this that you can't look at that amazing like and they're so moisturizing it's like i love them i love them y'all should invest i got them from walgreens i don't know if that was a sale or if that's just the price that walgreens sell them for but that was a bargain for me so sorry i was looking out my window because somebody parked in front of my house and i'm like i'm not expecting nobody to come over here who is that anyways uh what is your favorite underdog product okay i have never seen anybody talk about that oh crap i gotta get this off of me <laughs> look at i just did so I've never seen anybody talk about this. Um, I'm a very natural eye type of person. I don't like a lot of color and things like that. Unless I'm doing other people makeup. Then of course I have the colors. I just don't like a lot of colors on myself. I like the browns. The you know the tans. The golds. I like things like that. So um, underdog for me would be the this Maybelline um, little palette. Uh, it looks like this. I use this almost every day. I don't even understand why why it's gone. Why it's not gone right now. Only color I don't use is this base. Um, that's just too white for me. But I use the other three colors like every day. But yeah, this is this is my underdog. And I think I paid like I probably paid like four dollars for this. So that's my underdog. Next question. Let's see. Uh, a drugstore product that's overpriced. Okay. This product, this is the Revlon Photo Ready product. First off, I maybe it's overpriced to me because I hate this product. Like, I, I don't like it. And you would think I, I would love it because I love the Revlon Color Stay, but I hate this one. Um, I paid about $14 for this. I'm not the type to wear, like, I don't like glitter, like, little specks of glitter in my foundation. That is so horrible. Like, maybe it is for photos. Like, it's called Photo Ready. I model. I didn't like the way it showed up in my pictures. It's, it's not... $14. This, for this little bitty bottle, this is a one fluid ounce. $14. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is a one fluid ounce as well. I paid ten dollars for this, and I love it. And this is a one fluid ounce, and I paid fourteen dollars for this, and I hate it. Like it, it's literally been sitting in my my case. I don't I don't use it. Maybe I'll use it on someone else. I don't know. But this is overpriced, overpriced, overpriced. I hate it. Okay. Next question. It says, um, show your best drugstore dupes. I don't do dupes, um, so I don't have any. Last question. Drugstore product that isn't worth the hype. But the, the product I have is the Great Maybelline Great Lash um, Waterproof, this stuff. I use it all because, I mean, I it did the job, but it's just not worth the hype. Like, this is the brush. Uh, I have it in black. I have it in very black. Uh, but it just wasn't worth the hype for me. It, it, my go-to is the Maybelline Falsies Volume Express. I, I use this. I like my eyelashes to look 
out there this didn't do it for me i don't like this this was like i paid at the time like six dollars for this um i don't like it don't like it at all i don't like it i don't like it so i'll put a list below of all the things that i talked about in this video i'm about to go wash my arm because it look a hot mess so this is my eye heart drugstore makeup video like subscribe rate comment let me know other videos that you would like me to do and like i said i'm gonna continue to make videos hopefully i'll be able to upload every day love you <coughs> love you guys